stop everything. That sound just violated the laws of physics and made your soul leave your body for exactly 3.2 seconds. What you just heard isn't just an engine, it's automotive violence in its purest form. Welcome to the dark art of Ferrari's flat plane crank V8, the engine that makes grown adults weep and small children question reality. Here's a fact that'll blow your mind. Ferrari deliberately chose to make their engines more difficult to build, more expensive to manufacture, and more challenging to live with. Why? Because sometimes genius looks like insanity until it crosses 7,000 RPM and turns into pure automotive adrenaline. While everyone else was building V8s that purr like oversized house cats, Ferrari said, hold our espresso, and created an engine that screams like a Formula One car having an existential crisis. The insane engineering choice. Picture this, you're building a V8 engine. Common sense says use a cross-plane crankshaft. It's smoother, quieter, makes more torque down low. It's the safe choice, the comfortable choice. Ferrari looked at common sense and threw it out the window of a speeding 488 GTB. Instead, they went flat plane. All eight connecting rods aligned in the same geometric plane, creating what's essentially two screaming inline fours joined at the hip by pure Italian stubbornness. The result? An engine that vibrates like an earthquake at idle, but transforms into liquid lightning at 8,000 RPM. Mind-blowing performance facts. Ready for this? The Ferrari 458 Italia's 4.5-liter naturally aspirated flat plane V8 produces 562 horsepower. That's right, 125 horsepower per liter. To put that in perspective, that's like getting a full-sized horse to fit in a shoebox and then convincing it to run the Kentucky Derby. But here's the kicker. This engine revs to 9,000 RPM. You heard it, 9,000. Most car engines are begging for mercy at 6,500 RPM. The Ferrari's just getting warmed up. The sound science explosion. Every other V8 on Earth sounds like this. Deep, bassy, predictable. It's the automotive equivalent of elevator music. Ferrari's flat plane V8 sounds like this. It fires every 90 degrees of crankshaft rotation with mathematical precision. No gaps, no hesitation, just pure, relentless, spine-melting automotive fury. Scientists have measured it. The frequency range of a Ferrari flat plane V8 at full cry actually triggers the same neural pathways as hearing your favorite song. It's literally addictive. Ferrari didn't just build an engine, they built a dopamine factory. The 1973 revolution, nobody saw coming. 1973, Nixon's in the White House. Gas crisis is crushing America. And some mad scientist in Marinello, Italy, decides now is the perfect time to revolutionize engine design forever. Enter the Ferrari 308 GT4, the first production car with a flat plane crank V8. While everyone else was making engines more efficient and quieter, Ferrari was like, what if we made ours sound like a demon being exercised at 8,500 RPM? The automotive world thought they'd lost their minds. Turns out they were just 50 years ahead of everyone else. The impossible modern miracle. Fast forward to today, the Ferrari F8 Tributo. 710 horsepower from a 4-liter twin-turbo flat-plane V8. That's 177 horsepower per liter. If physics was a person, Ferrari just made it cry. Here's the impossible part. They added turbochargers, the natural enemy of that signature flat-plane scream, and somehow made it sound better. How? Italian engineering voodoo that mere mortals cannot comprehend. 0 to 60 miles per hour in 2.9 seconds. 0 to 100 miles per hour in 7.6 seconds. 0 to I need to change my pants in approximately 0.3 seconds. The copycat explosion. Step back to 2015. Ford drops a nuclear bomb on the automotive world. They put a flat plane crank in a Mustang. The Shelby GT350 suddenly sounded like a Ferrari's angry American cousin who'd been hitting the gym. McLaren went all in with flat plane V8s across their entire lineup. 
Lotus came crawling back to flat plane design like an ex begging for forgiveness. Even Chevrolet is rumored to be considering it for future Corvettes. Ferrari didn't just create an engine design, they started a revolution that's still spreading like wildfire through the automotive world. The beautiful suffering. Here's the twisted part. Ferrari could have made these engines smooth and comfortable. They have the technology. They have the engineers. Instead, they chose beautiful suffering. At idle, a Ferrari flat plane V8 shakes, like a paint mixer having a nervous breakdown. The steering wheel vibrates, the mirrors blur, your coffee cup literally bounces on the dashboard. But cross 4,000 RPM and something magical happens. The chaos transforms into symphony. The vibration becomes music. The suffering becomes ecstasy. It's automotive masochism at its finest. The addiction factor. Scientists at the University of Oxford studied this phenomenon. They found that the specific frequency pattern of a Ferrari flat plane V8 at full acceleration triggers the same dopamine release as winning the lottery, falling in love, or eating the perfect slice of pizza. Once you've experienced that 9,000 RPM crescendo, every other engine sounds like a broken washing machine. Ferrari didn't just build customer loyalty, they created a psychological dependency. The technical wizardry nobody talks about. Here's something that'll cook your brain. Ferrari's latest flat plane V8S use something called hot V turbocharging. The turbos sit inside the V of the engine, where temperatures reach surface of mercury levels. Most engineers would call this insane. Ferrari calls it Tuesday. The result? Turbo lag so minimal, it's basically theoretical. Throttle response so sharp it can cut glass. Power delivery so immediate, it bends the space-time continuum. The future is screaming. While everyone else is going electric and hybrid, Ferrari's doubling down on the flat plane V8. The SF90 straight ale combines a flat plane V8 with electric motors for 986 horsepower of pure automotive insanity. They're not just preserving the future of internal combustion, they're making it louder, faster, and more addictive than ever before. Mind-melting finale. So what have we learned? Ferrari took the hardest possible path to build a V8 engine. They chose vibration over smoothness, complexity over simplicity, screaming banshee wails over comfortable rumbles. And in doing so, they created something that transcends mere transportation. They built an emotional experience, a psychological trigger, a mechanical symphony that rewrites your DNA every time you hear it. The Ferrari flatplane V8 isn't just an engine, it's proof that sometimes the most beautiful things in life come from choosing the most difficult path. It's mechanical poetry written in fire and fury, performed at 9,000 RPM, and it will haunt your dreams forever. Because once you've heard that sound, once you've felt that violence, once you've experienced that addiction, you'll never be the same. Welcome to the flat plane revolution. Your ears will never forgive you.